Oh, fuck that. Okay, well, we should do... I just started recording, so we should do a quick recap for all of our viewer. Alright, you do it since you pretty much have the war in your head. Okay, so... L uh, last night we got to Gwyn, and we were like, okay, we don't want to finish the game yet because I still wanted to find Gwyndolin and craft that bow that I heard about. Um, so my plan was to run all over the world and talk to every NPC and try to find any information about Gwyndolin. Then uh, I gave up on talking to the NPCs after a while because they were saying a bunch of useless shit. And I just sat down with my bottomless box and read the description of all of my items, seeking lore. And I found a lot of interesting things, but the most interesting thing was the Dark Moon Seance Ring that refers to Gwendolyn as the deity, or the Dark Moon deity, and said that Gwendolyn is the only remaining deity in An Orlando. So, through a series of events, okay, well, Anthony got online and discovered, oh, uh, there's this place called the Dark Moon Tomb. Yeah, I'm the best. That I had forgotten about. And so I went there, and when I put on the Dark Moon Ring, this huge statue of Gwyn disappeared, and now we have discovered a secret tunnel and it's time to go in and get Gwendolyn's soul. Yeah, the lore is real. The lore is real. So I'm gonna turn human to summon Anthony. And okay, so this is a moon person, so I'm going to assume that they can shroud stuff or make stuff dark or something. Or maybe they're still sun related, so. <laughs> Maybe I'll put on flame resistance. Yeah, there's conflicting information about Gwendolyn, whether... Yeah, well, first of all, whether he is male or female, and second of whether it's Dark Sun Gwendolyn or Dark Moon Gwendolyn. When... Uh... When Gwendolyn talked to me, it was a female voice. I forgot if she said she was sun or moon or what, but yeah. Yeah, that's why it's confusing. She could be like a dual god or something, like... Yeah. Male answer, yeah. Also, oh, I, read a piece, I read a piece of lore. You did? On the Ring of the Sun's Firstborn, if you read it. Uh, I'm sure I did, but I don't remember what it said. Yeah, it's from Lord Gwyn's Firstborn, who inherited the sunlight. He oh, was yeah. a god of war, but he lost his anus, and <laughs> lost his deity status, and no one knows his name. Yeah, there's a similar thing on the sunlight medals. That says, uh, the symbol represents Lord Gwyn's firstborn, who lost his deity status and was expunged from the annals. But the old God of War still watches closely. Yeah. So many lore bombs in all the item descriptions. Do you see my sign? It's on the staircase. Uh, not yet. Oh god. I just got told to halt, and this is the tomb of the great Lord Gwyn. From who? I don't know. Was it a was okay. it a female? It's Gwendolyn. Oh, so yeah. I can't, her. can't really tell if the uh, voice is male or female, but he or she told me to kneel. Can you do it? I don't know. Now before I go in, I wanted to try. Like do if you I. Make... Oh. <laughs> oh, that's a good idea. But I wanted to see if uh, taking off that ring makes the statue reappear. Also, yeah, for me, when I walked in that tunnel, there was no voice telling me to halt. Because I think Guinevere has pretty much realized I won't listen to her. Mm -hmm. Okay, I can take off the uh, Dark Moon ring and still go in there. I'm gonna wear my speckled stone plate ring since I have no idea what might attack me. <coughs> also, I don't see a sign. Oh, it's on the. I'll put it at the bottom by those candles. Oh, I'll when I. 
when I stand in the middle of the candles, there's the option to kneel. Oh, I don't have that. Just do it. See what happens. All right. You there... might be able to enter a covenant. I'm nervous because a message says amazing trap ahead. Well, well I don't think they'd get mad at you if they want followers. It looks like it might be a covenant. How do you join the dark oh, moon? Uh, I'm doing it. O oh, disciple of the dark sun, thou hast journeyed far, hear my voice. If thou shalt swear by the covenant to become a shadow of Father Gwyn and Sister Guinevere, a blade that shall hunt the foes of our lords, then, then I shall protect thee, safeguarding thy person with the power of the dark moon. So it is a covenant. Yeah, I can now join the covenant if I want, want me to. to summon you and kill her and see what that happens first? Like what that does? Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. So you can choose the best option, because I, I cannot join that covenant. <laughs> Alright, just drop your sign down. Yeah, when I said no, Gwendolyn was like, then we shall not need speech, exit here, and go by your own design. So I hope that means he slash she is not pissed at me. No, it's just like, yeah, just fuck off. Okay, my sign is down at the bottom of the stairs. I see it. That well, <coughs> might be... Yeah, it's me. <laughs> That's you? What? No, I put down a sign before. Oh. This is spooky. Wait, you know what just occurred to me? What? That this might be considered part of an Orlando, as in, like where we fought Gornstein and Mog. Yeah. So, like, maybe they count as the area boss, so maybe we can't summon each other for this part. Yeah, because I see your ghost, but I don't see a sign. Yeah, I've been seeing your ghost, too. Alright, I guess I'll just walk in, and I, I guess I'll record. Yeah, that's a good idea. Actually, I don't have the program, so... Uh. Oh... Okay, another lore bomb on the Dark Moon Blade Covenant Ring. Go on. Gwendolyn, all too aware of his repulsive, frail appearance, created the illusion of a sister, Guinevere, who helps him guard over Anne Orlando. An unmasking of these deities would be tantamount to blasphemy. Well, this throws a huge wrench into my Seath and Priscilla and Gwendolyn theory. Especially since Gwendolyn is a man, after all. Well then, so much for that theory. Yeah. Is Priscilla ever explained? Cause that was, I thought that was a pretty good theory. Yeah, there wasn't, there's not really that much reference to her origin, just that she's an abomination that should not exist. It's gonna be great if I can just walk through the fog. And yes, every time you die, you don't start the bonfire. You have to run all the way back. That sucks. That is the annoying part. And since that bonfire is not lit, you can't just warp again? Nope. Well, maybe since I haven't killed that firekeeper, I can just walk through the fog. Yeah, it'll probably be easier for you. I can traverse the white light. It's happening. Oh god. Cutscene. What foolishness. What's it saying? By trespassing upon the great lord's tomb, whilst thou art a disciple of the dark sun. I shall not go unpunished. Oh, I see him. He just like teleported. Oh 
my god. These magic attacks suck. Did you die? No. I dodged through one batch of them. Oh my god, he pulls out a bow and starts shooting at you. Yeah, he's like all ranged as far as I can tell. Oh, wow, he has a huge attack. Okay, now I'm dead. <clears throat> he has, like, tentacles. It's creepy. Are you still fighting him? Yeah, I just got back to him. Oh, good. Okay, now the Firekeeper is attacking me. Oh, is it trespass? I guess so. I don't like this fire keeper. Is she talking to you? She did, but now she's just trying to kill me. Oh, she doesn't have a lot of health. Oh wow, she dodged one of my lightning spears. Very skillfully. Not the second one. Her days are numbered, with the one. She said, this woman is a threat, Master Gwendolyn. And I got a Firekeeper soul. Gwendolyn's my favorite too, who? GG, Gwendolyn. Did you kill him? I think so. I wonder if you can, like, get absolved of sin and rejoin the Covenant. by the machine gun arrow. Damn. GG. No breathe. can you get before he teleports away? Ow. Not close enough to hit him with a lightning spear. I think this hallway goes on forever. Maybe. Super Mario. Oh, I did get him with a lightning spear. I think he's getting more aggressive. Damn.
fuck you, Gwendolyn. One more lightning spear should kill him. He's very weak to lightning, surprisingly. You'd think being Gwyn's son would give him some resistance to that. GG. That's not a hard fight. No. I mean, I died of it, but that's because I was trying to learn his moves, and I'm not very patient. He says he put an eternal curse on me. Doubt it. Yeah, good luck with that, being dead. Oh, I can reach the end of the hallway now. Let's see what's there. It's a big room. With treasure. like flowers here. Is this a giant coffin? In the back room? I don't know, I don't look at it too hard. I noticed there are flowers sitting on top of it, which makes me think it's a coffin. He said it was Gwyn's tomb. What treasure do I get? Sunlight Blade Miracle. What? Sunlight blade. Boost right weapon with rays of sun. Very effective against dragons. Have we seen that on anyone in the game? Yeah, it's the Firekeeper's armor. Oh, okay. That makes sense. I guess. Rest in peace forever. Yep. Rest in pieces. And the third chest was empty. Yeah, it was empty for me too. Spooky. Maybe someone already grave robbed. Yeah. What's up with this one throne sitting here? I broke it. Hmm. That was Gwyn's favorite chair. <laughs> oh no. Yeah. Now he's... First times two. Now when we fight him, he's gonna be in super pissed off mode. You broke my chair? Oops, sorry Gramps. Oh boy. Mr. Blacksmith, what is up? Hmm, no big hat in sight. Might be in some obscure room. Time to investigate each prison. Hmm, I can make a moonlight butterfly horn with a plus 10 spear. Interesting. I always thought there was something that the horn could be used for. Oh man. Hmm. Choices? Yeah, I'm just looking at the stats for the dark moon bow before I craft it. It has way worse parameter bonuses. Well, kind of. Well, I'm definitely gonna make it. I'll just have to test it out. Dark Moon Bow has been created. 
How does it look? Oh, let me read the lore on it, of course. Bow born from the soul of the Dark Sun Gwendolyn, Dark Moon deity who watches over the abandoned city of gods and Orlando. This golden bow is imbued with powerful magic and is most impressive with moonlight arrows. Oh, it's smaller than I expected. It's smaller than a longbow. 